Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. As you can see, there's something Halloween on the table. Yes, it's time for the Haunted Haven collab. Hosted by Heather's Handmade Haven and Susan Tootsie Tucker's Created Adventures. This is Heather's third year on doing the Haunted Haven. This will be my second year for participating. The thing about Heather's co Haunted collab is that at the end of the collab you have a partner that you um, ship to. So my partner is Lauren Cunningham and she is on J IG so if you want to go s give her some love on IG and show what she is going to be making I do appreciate. But there are more ladies in this collab as well. They will be linked down below in the description box. So this year is a little different. It is Crafter's Choice. It is three um, dates that we will be um, uploading. So keep an eye out. I believe it's the 17th, the 24th, and I believe Halloween or the day before Halloween. It's on the it's on a Friday. So here we go. So I contacted Laura and I had contacted one another and didn't know what to actually do with the crafter's choice you know you kind of want to make it kind of equal that you guys send each other the same amount or what you want to do so then like I'm not making a gnome and she's making a you know something else so we have decided because of the cost of shipping that we would do something simple to ship so we have decided on excuse me, a pocket letter with goodies, a memdex, an ATC card, and a pack of four embellishments. So that's what we're going to do. So my crafter's choice on week one is going to be the pocket letter. Now, I will say this, she will already have had this. I, I was struggling on this, so she should already have this because I will be mailing out because I am pre-recorded. This is October 2nd, and I'm pre-recording this so I can get this out to her next week. So the first thing you have is I went ahead and my mom got me some of these little spiders, which very cute. I kept one for myself, um, and I kept them so I can remake some other ones. So I figured that would be cute with just a little tassel and I got to fix that. Put his, her little spider on there. Um, I don't know where he went, but there's a little spider that goes there. So I went ahead and the first week is my pocket letter. Now, uh, you guys know how to do a pocket letter, so we're just going to get right to it. I did a lot. I decided that I wanted to do more of a Halloween because it is Halloween, but like the more of the purple because it's my favorite color and it's a Halloween color. So I did a lot of purple and some stripes reminding me of the witch's stockings and then the orange down at the bottom. So a traditional kind of Halloween type thing. Um, all this actually is from the Dollar Tree. Everything here has been fussy cut, other than like these are foam stickers. From the journaling cards from the Dollar Tree. Okay, yes, these are the big ones. But what I have done is I cut out this part of it. So it's little and they're perfect for going on pocket letters. So I went ahead and that's what I have done. Then I put Happy Halloween here with a ghost and a little uh, like a werewolf with bones did a lot of fussy cutting let me tell you guys that's the house that went with that with the spooky tree and then you come over here and it's the jack-o-lantern oh, that little spider always drives me nuts so we'll get it like that look a look at Frankie taking the witch in the stew so there you have it and then down here. See if I can correct it a little here. There you go. And that's how that goes. Very simple. And then on the side, I went ahead and found some orange lace 
to cover up this on the side just to make it a little prettier. So what I have done, because I decided, oops, hello, I'm stuck. What I've done is um, you always have goodies, and that's what we decided to do as goodies in the pocket letter. So instead of putting the goodies in here, um, I just put my name that it was October 2021, Heather's third annual Haunted Haven collab slash swap. So then she knows when we swap together. Okay. I'm not going to put the goodies on here because it always makes it bulky and there's sometimes that they rip. So I went ahead and I made her a little note thanking her for being part of this. This is from the Dollar Tree um, that you hang. I, this was last year. And that's from Walmart's thing. So I just went ahead and these are a couple things that can't fit in there anyways. So I, I gift her a couple of skeletons. Ooh, some booze. I do apologize about the wicker in here. And then here is her goodie bag. So everything that I wanted to put in here won't fit. So I had a bag that I had gotten from a friend that dyes paper. And it's just a purple bag. Here is my sugar skull that I have went ahead and made it into a shaker and all the goodies are in this bag. So guys, this is what I have for week one for you and I hope you enjoyed um, everything that you see and please go down in the description and see what all the other ladies are deciding to do with their partners. Until next time guys, please stay safe and keep crafting. Bye for now.